Hi everyone, I just wanted to share with you a swap um, that I was in over at the craft hole. Um, it's, this is actually two swaps and some goodies and some extra extras. And my Valentine's challenge. This is from um, Rosemary Bustillos. I know I butchered that. Um, she Here on, um, on YouTube, she's 505 Crafts. So this is what she made me. She made me this cute altered box which is awesome um i love that she used a little tim holtz jump ring right here i love that that's i love this little piece um and that's a great idea to use it like that but um i've got a bunch of flowers in there that's why it won't close but look how cute this is beautiful flower beautiful center beautiful paper it looks like she's all edged too she's got um pearl trim on it and then the bottom are spools wrapped with um, ribbon. I like that it looks like a corset, too. That's very cool. Um, our, our challenge was to make flowers. So this is the flower swap. Look how beautiful this blue one is. That's just gorgeous. On this navy and darker blue. And this is um, a satin. Sorry, my lighting is horrible. Let's try it. Okay. And then this beautiful one here. This one's got a gorgeous center too. She does, this is like the melted flower technique. I use this technique myself and it's very pretty. This one is um, got lace as well as uh, an organza. This one is um, satin and um, lace with a cool button. This one is crocheted. I wish I knew how to crochet. This one is so cool. This is made from a doily. I don't know if she dyed the doily, but I love it. it's, I've never seen one like this. It's so pretty. And this is muslin. She did a lot of different ones too. I love that. Look at this button. It's cool. I love the stamp that she has. Those are her initials RB. It doesn't show up good on the back of the flowers, but I'll show it to you on something else. Look. Isn't that cool? That's something else she made me. I'll show you guys in a minute. Oh, this did kind of go out. Okay. This beautiful tulle flower. This gorgeous flower here. This is really cute how she did this. It's huge. <laughs> she used those wrappers like the cupcake wrappers like I did. And this one. Oh, this is beautiful. I don't know what this material is called. Is this called organza? I'm not really sure, but it's beautiful. I love these buttons. Again, this is like um, shabby chic. And it's ribbon. It could be like a curtain or something. That's what mine is on. And this is really pretty. This is um, satin and um, lace. The little baby ones. That's pretty. these little black lollipops. Cute, huh? So, well, not even the box is lined. It's, it's a very nice box. Let me put these all back in here. We were only supposed to do 10 flowers, and you can see she sent me a lot more than 10. Um, then, well, we've got a couple things going on here. And then she made me this, which is beautiful. It's a tea. And is it the same paper? Yeah, I believe it's the same paper, so it matches. And then she's got a cherub on the bottom with another one of her flowers and a little fan. And you can see she's got bling up here, and it's all it got uh, flat back pearls all over it. And the top, which I thought this is a really cute idea with the rosette, she's got a little bling in the center of the rosettes. Can you see that? I'm sorry, my iPhone doesn't focus well. And... Um, She's got lace around the bottom, so I don't know what she has it on. I'm going to see. These are beautiful stick pins. i got to try to use more metals in my stick pins. It's beautiful. The cherub. Thank you so much. That was such a sweet surprise. Then, let's see. Then we were in an ATC swap together. And I love the way she did her ATCs. 
I think it was a lot of our first time, um, first time was at the craft hole to do ATCs, um, and she did a beautiful job. But I love the back of her ATCs. I thought I saw um, a free download for these, but I didn't use it. And I love that she uh, embossed them with this shim with this cool um, shimmer, glitter. But anyway, it and you guys probably know about this, but I've never, well, I've never done ATC cards. But because you, you title your card, the artist, the date. Um, and then the contact information in the series. So I thought this was cool. Um, so she did this, which is a bal here balloons. And it says fly away. It's very pretty. You can see she pieced the papers here. It's very pretty. Embossed it. This is a really pretty boss. I love that plastic sleeves that she put in there. I'm going to get some of those. So, Rosemary, you need to tell me where to get those sleeves. And this one's very pretty. This texture is so cool. I don't know if you guys can see that, that texture. Very nice. And I like that they're all different. We were supposed to do, I don't know, I think we were only supposed to do three. Awake, Alive, Blast. And I love... This looks like a feather and it's got all this shimmer and stuff on it. This, it's just so beautiful. This one is titled Love Life. What is this title? Vintage Royalty. <laughs> and then this is really cute. The texture on these is amazing. This one says, families are like fudge, mostly sweet with a few nuts. Isn't that the truth? And this is called Family Tree. Isn't that beautiful? And you, she does a really good, tut great tutorial. She's very um, detailed in her descriptions. So you might want to go over to her channel and check it out. I will put it in the description box below. Um, and I just want to show, all, all this stuff was packaged so nicely, too. And then this is her entry to my Valentine's Challenge, which is so cool. I think she taught a class. I went to a class on this where... Um, it's all pieces of paper put together. It just looks really cool. It has lots of texture. Um, she even did the paper piece over the heart. It's beautiful. I love these. I bought these too. I love them. And then one of her homemade flowers in a bow. It's like a little box. But I don't know. It's kind of thick. I'm not sure what it's made from. Again, I know she did a video. So you can go check out her video. And it is filled with little goodies in here. And she sent me a bunch of goodies. I got a lip gloss, some tea stickers, these pretty little paper flowers, which are really pretty colors, really neutral colors. There are a couple of these hearts in here. A little love bug stamp. A couple napkins. And this really cute plastic. All these little paper flowers, which are really pretty. Thank you. Some eyelash um, fiber on a mannequin. And then this fan to um, alter. My cousin Cody just altered a fan. I don't know if you guys had seen it, but you need to go to Cat Cody's Crafty Corner and check out her fan. And she wrote on it, um, alter using Frida Kahlo. Isn't that cool? I love Frida Kahlo. This is awesome. I'll have to look up tutorial on that. And then she sent me this graphic 45 pen which I think is so pretty. I love graphic 45 paper. Thank you so much, Rosemary. I love it, love it, love it. Everything is wonderful. I was such a happy camper today when I got all this. I really appreciate the effort that you took into making everything for me. Um, all the special treats, this wonderful tea. It's my second tea that I got. You can see I got a tea over there. Um, and it'll be nice to have these things to show when I am doing my videos, if I want, you know, talking or something, something to, to put the camera on. So I uh, thank you so much. Um, again, let me show you my, her Valentine entry. That's for her Valentine's challenge. These are the beautiful ATCs she's made me. And then the box I've already put down. Thank you again. Um, I will put a link to her channel so you guys can go check out her tutorials. She's really talented. Thank you so, so much.